We're today we're having to call his manager David Chadwick after 2 0 loss at home against Worksop. Runs for the game, Chaddy. I think we give it everything, didn't we? Uh, considering a few things that went against us again. I, I don't know what we've done to somebody up there at the minute, but losing players, we lost two, didn't we, last week? I lost Ahmed last night, I lost Teddy after eight minutes today, Enoch after 20, and, and your back's up against it. And that's I've just said to the guys that uh, I'm so proud of where you performed. So, you know, they, they scored early doors and they were on top in the game for me. And then we grew into the game, first half. They, they had a lot of possession away from our, our defensive third, which, which is fine. Um, but they've got so much quality. They're, they're big, strong, physical, so many players from leagues above. And they just tried to wear us down. But our defence again was solid. Jack Evans was brilliant. Mo, class, Dylan Mooney, unbelievable. Dylan Thompson did well. And even Tom behind him, he had to make a couple of snap saves, which he did. And then in the second half, we come out and and we we took the game to him. I thought we could have had a couple of we had a couple of half chances ourselves, um, and we were lucky not to score. And they've scored off a set piece near the end, haven't they? Um, which I'm disappointed at because we'd switched off, and then the, it was done. Then, but we never stopped fighting after it. Young Liam Shepherd come on again, ran his heart off. You know, Ethan come off the bench and we were a bit disjointed when we lost the two in the first half but we managed, we called to him and we went back right at him and yeah, I'm, I'm proud as anything of the boys. Alright, so today's a marked improvement last week as well. Massive, yeah. What, how must it be for yourself to see the players take it all on board even though the predicament were in? I'm, I'm, like I said before, I'm proud of them. Their attitudes all season have been spot on. They could, they could have... Would they, Hidden away and and you know, not been interested, but they fought tooth and nail all season, and you can you can count on one hand for me how many times they've, they've let you down as a, as a team. And I said that last week, Joe, you know, where we've we've never been in the game. You know, again today we're in the game against a promotion contender, and and they had to work really hard to get them points today. And on another day it could have finished one all, but it's. It's story of our season, isn't it? You know, we've been so close so many times, and, and that's what you get with youngsters. You know, we know that, and it's it's hard to take sometimes because them kids put so much into their into the games. I think someone said to me, "We've we've been in front in that many games. We've lost 46 points from winning positions. If that's right, you think, well, where could you be with it with half of that? Do you know? But again, youth, it's." Sometimes you need them experienced players to, to, to man games and game management, just run the clocks down and stuff. Um, and it's been hard for him, it's been a learning curve for the lads. And, you know, Jimmy's telling him he loves them all in there now, he's nearly crying. <laughs> Bless him. But they've, they've worked hard all season. And, and it's what a squad to take into next year. Do you know? You know, if we can keep them all, great. Let's do it and let's build on it. And, and we're looking forward to it. Obviously, last week you mentioned about the fans as well. I'm back at home, final long game of the season. It must be good to see so many fans there remain after yeah. they're clapping the lads. Yeah, they were loud all game. Um, never shirked, willing the lads on. They've been brilliant all season. And I'm glad they got a performance where they could go, do you know what? They might be promotion contenders, but you know, we give them a right good go. We never give in, which we didn't. And we've done that a lot this season. Cheers to time, Shelley.